welcome everybody thank you for tuning in if you have been subscribed make sure you click the subscribe button when i upload more episodes you won't miss out okay so question 6b as displayed here it says use the mail match function to prepare the letters to the premiers which is a primary document and then we must use korean u12 to type the letter before you type anything here you will have to make sure that you change the font and the font size so korea news the font that we're using and the font size i ch change it here and then it's 12. so you do this before you type so that anything that you're going to be typing will be typed according to korea new 12. any other thing that you will be changing later on it will be changing according to the instructions given to you but the primary font that we're using is korea new 12. now number two says as a header key in your examination number left and question 6b right aligned ensure that you use the same font type and size as in the rest of the document so it means that now we are going to go and click insert on my tools there then i go to header and then remember here i normally tell you that you have to take the three blank columns three columns header so that you can have places to type on both directions or sides so here is your examination number so i'm just going to type an examination number so you put yours there now here on this side it will be question 6b what is it now appearing at the center you click and you delete so that you don't lose any marks for accuracy so now when you say close header now your cursor is blinking on the area where you can start to type the letter number three says insert the following heading in broadway 18 pt capital letters and centered so it means now before we can even start with the letter we have to insert the heading there on top so this heading is going to have its own font so now i will start with the heading and then change the font later so i will type the heading here stay home exclamation mark stay safe another exclamation mark then i will have to highlight this and change it to broadway 18 pt highlight font size font type first is broadway the easiest way is just to search it here and say broadway broadway and then we change it to 18 there so now when we look at the question paper here on the instructions again concerning this heading they said it must be in capital letters and centered so i can can just go and click center here and then it's centered so now meaning that when i press enter to start with my other things or the letter i have to make sure that there i have to change back to korea new and then make it 12 so that the whole letter that you're going to be typing is not going to be appearing in Broadway Sense 18. When we look at the question number four, it says insert fields were indicated by brackets. So it means when we type the letter, we'll be inserting the fields. You don't type them. Okay. So now I'm going to type the letter and then later on we'll insert the fields and then you will learn on how to start inserting the fields. so now as we are starting to type the letter obviously i will make sure that now my cursor is blinking on the left hand side by putting it to left align then the first thing that we see on the letter on the question paper as you see displayed here it says we must set the left uh, the tap stop it says we have to set a tap stop of 5.08 centimeter from the left hand margin so meaning that i have to set the taps and then we can start to type center for disease control and prevention so when you look at my document here i will have to go now and click paragraph group and then there i will go to tabs and then on the tab stop now i will say 5.08 and then it will be a left tab like this so now this comma here i will put a comma for me because my computer recognizes comma and not dots then i will have to put left and then click set so now it's set when it goes to the big box there then i click ok you will see now on my ruler there there's an indication that there's a 
tap stop or 5.08 so now what you have to do to start you press tap on the keyboard there and then you can type and then the second line again after pressing enter you press tap and so on right so now after typing everything on the letter you will see that other texts are not having supposed to have on the question paper they are not supposed to have double line spacing or multiple spaces so this will remain a single line spacing so i will highlight and go to spacing and leave it as 1.0 and then i will also make sure that my text in my paragraphs are one point uh, then even here i will make sure that it's one comma zero so then you will see that your letter will end up fitting on one page then the when i was typing the other text that i was leaving out is when you have to insert the match fields so we cannot type the match fields but you insert them if you look at your question paper now you will see that the first match fields that you had to insert it's where after you inserted the date up there it says insert the date insert today's date so when we insert today's date up there under the above the the premiere so it means we must have two line spaces so normally what i do i switch on the show and hide so that i can see how many spaces i'm leaving behind below your address here we have space one space two left out and then here on number three that is when i'm going to insert today's date so you can just go and click insert and then choose date there and then you ch just choose the date and click OK. So the date will appear there. So the more you leave the show and hide icons, those are representing your spaces. So even here, I have to leave two of them. And then now the premiere is typed there. Just below the premiere here, I have to insert uh, province and town. But remember that those are match fields. So they are coming from the data source that we have saved. So we'll start by going to mailings. And then I'll have to go and click insert match field, use existing list. So my list has been saved. So I have to go and find the list under my folder where I'm putting all the, the work that I'm doing. So when I go there, I will find it under the folder that I've saved. Question 6a, I click it and then I click open. So you will see that now after doing that, my tools are active so that I can use them. So under Premiere there, we know that we have to insert a match field because it's appearing in brackets and that is province. So I will go and say insert match field and then I choose province. Then under province there, I press enter. Then you will see that that is another place where I have to insert town. I go now, I click there, I choose town. And then I have to leave two spaces only below tau then now we see dear after just after dear there i put a space bar not enter because i have to insert title there then i choose title 
and then after title another space there and the space bar on my keyboard then i will put initials and say name so when i go to insert field initials and say name is one field there two spaces after town i leave them then there is my heading there re-invitation and then after that i have to leave two spaces again there my show and hide is showing and then there is the paragraph so within the paragraph as you see there where it says the meeting will be held the meeting will be held there it is the meeting will be held at the now there the space that i left there the meeting will be held held at now we go and insert venue and then in after in then now i have to insert town there i have to insert town then i go and type town i don't type it actually i insert it from from the match fields so after inserting town then we will see that there's another match field there after town there's a comma then after the comma there i have to put the province so i go now and click and choose province after province there it says over it reads as follows over a video over a video conference call the meeting uh, the time allocated for the meeting is and then now there i have to put time smh field so i go and choose time and then i have to get two spaces after that so after time there's a full stop and then i have two uh, spaces after that paragraph so after that paragraph now starts a paragraph or a sentence that says if for any reason there it is then it says that uh, if for any reason you cannot attend the meeting please do not hesitate to call the office then after that we see that i have to leave two spaces as well then it says regards then there are two spaces as well and then after that the two spaces there then i will see that now it's where we have the ending of saying that secretary now above all this letter up there you have to make sure that the space is not um we don't have unnecessary space in there so i will just scroll up and then now uh just below the heading there there we were not it does not indicated how many spaces we should leave so i will just press backspace a little bit then it went up and then now we have spaces just below the first tab stop there so when i go and scroll down secretary fits well on one page everything is on one page and then now when we look at the next question here question 6c it says merge 6a and 6b to form a new document so this is your document for question 6b obviously you will print it out now for question 6c it says match 6a and 6b to form a new document so meaning that you have to firstly preview the results now you will see that uh, you don't only have the letter with match fields but it shows that you have western cape the province is appearing mr a window is appearing after clicking there which says show results and then now if i go to mailings again preview results is clicked if i unclick it it means i'm going back to my primary document but when i click preview results i'm showing the things that i've typed so question two now says change the header to question 6c so when i go now to the header there and change it to question 6c type c there in caps it means that now i can be able to show all the letters so meaning that when you go to mailings you go to the last point where you say finish and merge edit individual documents and then you click where it says all and then you click ok so meaning that now i'm expecting three letters this is a letter for mr a wind then the second letter will be for mr d makura then the last letter will be for mr s zigalal so all of them they have the same letter but addressed to different places because we have used the data source correctly thank you for watching